so now I'm going to be looking at the a summary of the film poster of Seven Pounds. What I learned from Seven Pounds is that the simplest things can change a person's view of everything. And personally, I think Seven Pounds is, though it's normal, uh, like a normal um, film poster, the simplicity of the Seven Pounds film cover is what draws you in. Um, obviously, um, the film itself got um, had a lot of fan base because Will Smith is the main character and most people go to see a Will Smith film. It's quite common. But the film poster lies to you in a sense that you look at it and you think, normal film? If you don't look closely and you don't look deeper at the tagline, Seven Strangers and seven, str seven Strangers just entices you in as it is because you look at him going seven pounds, he's a man he's in a suit, you look at the iconography, the colours, you're thinking right, he's in, he's in the bank or something like that and from seven pounds he made a great success of himself and when you when you look at the denotations and the connotations of the of the film poster, you, you would think that, it's natural for you to think that, but actually it's the complete opposite to that. And the only thing that only thing in that post that film poster that gives it away is the shadow part on the on one side of his face. And that is the only key that there's this is not gonna go as well as you think it is. Um shadows generally are hiding something and you once you look at the shadow you can't take your eyes off the shadow of his face, the shadow that's on his face and though it's so simple it's so intriguing and interesting how you could be so oblivious to something so simple and so easy to spot and that would be an amazing idea for our group and the storyline that i have as a group and in, within the group and looking at it the simplicity of it would help our group because again nothing is taken away from his face and his weak smile his smile is not a normal happy smile it's more of a mugshot a bit like a passport photo a bit like he's done something wrong and when you strip back the image itself and look at it clearly not just oh it's Will Smith on a film and he he looks all right so it must be a good film about money actually when you strip it all back you can see that he's not smiling properly his smile is weak therefore saying like symbolizing that he's not that happy it looks the white background is not completely white so seeing that it's not really it's more like a mugshot which can be related to passport photos but it also can be related to the photos that they take at police station they can make you have a straight face and then they make you hold up a number it it just represents more than it gives off to the audience and as many audience will see the film poster and they will just walk straight past it only because they won't connotate it to as to a deeper level, as uh, as uh, as someone like a media student would, and when you do look at it, it it makes you think of other things that could be could have gone wrong. It makes you develop your own narrative of a film before you put before you've even seen it, and looking at the tag the tagline and look and looking at how well it's just placed nicely in between different things so you don't actually notice it as much as it is despite the fact that it's in red which is red is also symbolize symbolizes passion love and as well as danger and caution and hurt and distraughtness so you piece these things together black symbolizes funerals symbolizes grief symbolizes darkness and then it's subverted by white which is mainly seen as something angelic, perfection, um, something that bloom is gloss is 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 blossomed. Do you know it, it? Everything connotates each other, and because of that it confuses the target audience. And I think confusion makes 
you want to see the film more because it's confused you so much. You just you, you can't be confused anymore. You have to go and watch the film to settle your mind. And if my my film poster could in interpret that simplicity of confusion, it would be a really intriguing and helpful poster for people to come in and and watch this film. And with support by the trailer and the magazine cover. I think that um, Seven Pounds itself is a complicated film and watching it, it watching the and analyze and actually analyzing what's going on in the film trailer and in the magazine cover and the film poster, it, it makes you see the things that you tend to miss when you're watching um a film poster when you're watching a trailer or a film or looking at a film poster for pleasure um because you want to go see a film on the weekend with your family it is it's when you actually analyze it it's deeper than that and i think that's the main thing that intrigues the audience to come and see it it's because of its simplicity which makes you want to see it <laughs>